On Tuesday, May 10th, 2016, the Correctional Service of Canada threw open the doors to its Collins Bay Institution and invited the media to come in and take a look around. It's mind-boggling, really. I mean, you're you're uh, you're given access to an area that uh, most of the time we're standing at the at the end of the driveway shooting. It was an opportunity to let them see with their own eyes the great work that we do. They were given access to all levels of this clustered site, from segregation to maximum to medium to minimum. The pictures they took and the footage they shot will be shared with hundreds of media outlets in Canada and throughout the world. And I think a lot of our viewers would be very interested to see what goes on inside a prison, what the cells look like. There's a lot of misconception or there's a lot of stereotypes uh, based on what they see on television or in the movies. I think that it's important for the media to have access to the prison, to the interior of the prison, to the interior of the murs, to be able to show people from the exterior comment ça se passe en dedans. On voit souvent à la télé une réalité qui n'est pas vraiment la réalité, surtout dans les émissions de télé. On voit que c'est très calme, très contrôlé, euh, même les détenus, euh, nous étant là dans la cour avec les détenus, il n'y a pas de tension comme on le penserait. If the experience on May 10th was any indication, the minds and perceptions of individual reporters were changed by what they saw. They were excited and eager to share their stories with other Canadians. That's incredible to, to be able to go through an institution like Collins Bay. I mean, you, growing up here, you always look at, the it's known as the castle to, to residents in Kingston, but to actually go inside and understand uh, what happens here day to day. It's a pretty neat experience to be able to see and understand, you know, how an exceptional search works. Um, you know, how inmates are moved around the facility. It really, uh, I think in the future, will help with me writing stories. And why not? Canada has one of the most progressive and innovative federal correctional systems in the world. It is a story that should be told.